Hello, hello, Roxana, how are you? Fine, thanks, teacher. What was the exercise that you had a question today? Oh, it's in session one. Uh huh. Uh, oh, sorry, but I, I don't have my. It's the. Wait. I don't remember what is the. One point. So now let me check about. Wait, wait a minute. Yes. Roxana, did you find it? No, teacher, sorry, but I, I didn't, I don't have open to my, I did, I don't enter to my, plat in the plat on the platform. Oh, sorry. okay. Sorry. Oh, okay. I tried in my, ta in my tablet. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, hello, Mirna, how are you? Very well, teacher. Thank you. Welcome. You? Very good. Very good. We're going to go ahead and move forward and get started. I would like for us to go to the first section, which is section 1.5, listening exercise. I would okay. like for you to listen to the audio program. Which person do you think would be more likely to do these things this weekend? Choose the right answer. First, okay. I would like for you to tell me what did you do this weekend? Past time with my family. When I go to the chores. Oh, yeah, I, I went. I went, <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. I went to the chores. Mm -hmm. Only that teacher. Excellent. What church do you go to? Yes. What is the name of your church? Linaje Escogido. Oh, okay. Nice. <laughs> and how long have you been going to church? Almost 20 years. Oh, that's nice. And who do you go to church with? With my mother, my sister. 
my daughter, my nephew. Mm -hmm. Your whole family. Yes. And have you seen any activity related to the new law in your area? No. Everything has been calm? What? Everything has been calm? Todo está qué? Calmado? <laughs> I don't... Yes. <laughs> okay, that's good. Yes. That's good. What about you, Roxana? How was your weekend? What did you do this weekend? Well, I went to the church and I got to work. I went to work with my, my mother. Oh, really? What what do you do at work? I, I sell salt. Mm -hmm. vegetable on the market mm -hmm, mm -hmm. what kind of vegetables do you sell uh yucca mm -hmm. and cabbage mm -hmm. and uh i don't know how can i say uh yerbas or herbs 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 Her herbs herbs okay. yes very good very good hello alexander welcome how are you hello how are you very good roxana ask alexander the question <gasps> alexander respond to the question okay okay how was your weekend alexander good very good Tyler, what did you do good <laughs> Uh, really, I work because I have a lot of work. I want a project and I work at night, Saturday and Sunday and Monday. You yes, work hard. But really good, really good. You work and, hard on yes. weekend too? <laughs> yeah. But too, um, I celebrate my, uh, my wife. It was a birthday day. And oh, celebrate. Really? Yeah. Yes. Oh, what did you do to yeah. celebrate? Uh, we're going to go to the uh, seafood because um, her family liked the seafood and the idea is to share. And we're going to the La Libertad and eat some food. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. What yeah. restaurant did you visit? Uh, we're going to Café Sunsal. Ah, okay. That's a nice yes. place. Yes, it's a nice place. And Excellent. delicious food. Yes, yes, yes. All right, Alex, select somebody. Okay, let me see. Ana Pineda. Okay, ask Ana Pineda the question. Hello, Ana Pineda. Hi, hello. How, how was your weekend, your last weekend? Good and tired. Okay. Yesterday I was uh, organizing all my closets. I was uh, throwing away clothes, shoes, bottles, everything. Wow, good. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Spring cleaning. Spring, mm -hmm. Yes, I was cleaning all day long. <laughs> That's okay. good. That's good. Uh, Ana Pineda, select somebody. Uh, let me see. Doris. Doris, ask Doris the question. Doris, how was your weekend? Hi, uh, Anna and everyone. It was very funny because I went, uh, I had as date with my mom, we went to take a, a coffee the station. And also I went with my sister-in-law to the market and supermarket. <laughs> and rest in my house, only that. Nice, nice, excellent. Go ahead, Thank Doris. You. 
Select somebody. Marvin Calix. Marvin Calix. Ask Marvin the question. Hi, Marvin. How was your weekend? Hi, Doris, and hi, everyone. My weekend uh, that's uh, uh, Saturday. I was working, making fixes on the roof of my house. I was working hard. In Sunday, I was working hard on the platform. All right. Make, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that was my weekend. All right, excellent, excellent. Very good. All right, guys. Who can tell me what information do you remember about the previous class? What information do you remember about the previous class? Who can give me an example? Hi. Hello? Me. Okay, go ahead. Uh, I used to be strong, but now I'm friendly. Okay. And I'm interested in improving my vocabulary in English. Excellent. Okay, so in the previous class, we were talking about how have you changed? So I would like for everybody to give me some examples about how you have changed from the past to now. I'm going to let you practice in pairs and then everybody is going to speak about how you have changed your personality, your habits, your responsibilities, things like that. Okay. Speaking practice. Okay. Hello. Anna. Hi, hello. Hello, how are you? Fine. I just already into the class, so I don't know what I'm going to do. Oh, yeah. we are going to talk about the about the last class. Okay. To talk about how how was oh, I, I I lost my <laughs> my how was your how was your change? I don't remember the, exactly the. Uh, how? If you have changes in your personality, in your activities. Okay, okay. But this is discuss about that. Okay. For example, I remember I say I used to be shy but now I am a little talkative. Yeah. Well, uh, my teacher my said at the university, <laughs> you are talkative. <laughs> but I remember in, in, that when I studied at my first career at the university, uh, after graduate of high school, I remember I, I was, I used to be shy. Okay. But I changed. Yeah. What about you? Tell me. Me and I used to be like relaxed, and now I'm a little anxious. 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 Uh -huh. What's the meaning? Anxious. Like anxious. I'm saying is this correct? Ah, uh, anxious. Anxious. Uh -huh. Yeah. I don't. I'm not sure about the pronunciation, but I understand. Anxious. Yes, and everything. It make me like fears of things. 
and I, I don't use to be like that. People t tell me that it's, because it's for the stress, but I don't know. It probably. And do mm -hmm. you have, do you eat uh, more when you are no. anxious? No, 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 I don't. I In don't. my case, yes, when I am anxious, I, I ate a lot. <laughs> yes, me too. <laughs> really? No. Yes, even when I had exams at the university, was terrible. Yeah. <laughs> because the nervous, so I ate a lot. It's the same to me. Yeah. And in my case, I used to be unpunctual. Uh -huh. and, but now I am trying to, to arrive on time at the place. The place. Whatever the place. <laughs> Whatever place, yeah. It's, it's, in my case, it's, I used to be for you. punctual. I used to now no because in, in my job nobody's punctual punctual. Really? Why? Yes. I don't know. You you said a meeting for for in at a specific hour and nobody's it's in the hour. Yeah, my uh, job, I'm not to be punctual. And do you receive a penalty about that? No. <laughs> This no, this count or or an I don't know. <laughs> no. Oh, you do. You have a a nice boss, I think. Yes. Oh. <laughs> yes. In my case, my boss is um so angry when when people arrive. Uh, yes. Later. Yes, it's no, rare. It's no. Yes, it is a little weird. It's strange. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's strange that your that uh, that your boss not angry about it, about your not punctuality. Mm -hmm. Yes, nobody respect the hour. I used to get angry, but now I <laughs> I, I don't. <laughs> when I but when I said the, the meeting you don't care about it no if, if the meeting I organ if I organize the meeting I, I said please be punctual yeah mm -hmm. yes in in my work uh, because we have um, like uh, how do you say um, marcador I don't know, but with the face. Mm -hmm. Yes. And a lot of money, but today, um, but now, um, changing my point of view about the man. I like to use a car, but in this moment, I can't uh, try it. <laughs> My family, I, I have a, a wife, a daughter. Okay. And I remember that when I was a kid, oh, I used to be a lazy boy. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. But... Uh, but now I, I consider myself a workaholic. Uh, really? Yeah, I try to work hard and not just to try, but enjoy what I do in my job. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because um, I think that, uh, that I, I don't know how to say, I, I know I try to spend my time because you know uh, there is a saying that it says that time is gold. Yes, of course. 
Of yeah, course. yeah. Mm -hmm. Every second of my life, I try to make uh, worthy to, uh -huh. to live. Yes. Yes, not just for me, but for my family, for all the people around me. Yes. I try to, uh, I don't know, dejar un legado, something like that. Yes, uh -huh. Yes. And I can say that I have the life that I really want. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yes. That's good. You know, I I born in San Salvador, but I grew up in Il Vasco, Cabana. Il Vasco. Yeah. Yes. And do, yes. did you have family there? Yes, yes. My my brothers live in in, in Il Vasco. Two brothers in her families, in his families. Uh, realize all the activities. <laughs> Mm, is have to finish for what day? Now? <laughs> no, ahora. The section number two, yes. Oh, it's missing a lot. <laughs> Hi, Alex and teacher. Hello, how are you? Hello. Hello. I'm how fine. You? You? <laughs> Tell me, how do you change? Do you remember a long time ago and right now? What? There is Omirna. How Hello. do you change? Tell me. Yeah. Um, I used to be a lazy girl, but <laughs> now I'm changing. <laughs> really? But right now you have you have a family. Yes, <laughs> for that reason maybe. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. good. No, yes. Uh, you point of view about the life change when you have children. <laughs> uh -huh. Yes, of course. But it's beautiful. Yes. I enjoy my daughter. Yes. Ooh, I like yes. the child. Ooh, I like it. Yes. Yeah. And you you want to change your life, you want to change your um so another thing that you want to change. Also, well, those are um, my things. Yeah. Well, in my past, I I just I just started. But now I'm working and as well, I'm working but with some friends. It's because I have a lot of like a five or four uh, job. One guy uh, told me sometime, hey, why you all time you have a, a, a dibujada, draw your, your smile. I do all the time. I smile. Yeah. Okay. But right now, when I marry, I change because the responsibility. Uh, my wife sometimes is angry, <laughs> and <laughs> but it, it's, it's beautiful. I enjoy yeah. my family, but it's different. Yeah. Really, it's different. Yeah. Yeah. But in never, I remember never I was. Uh, lazy, never. My parents never, eh, nunca me dejaron <laughs> to be a lazy. Okay. Mm -hmm. That is good. Yeah. Yes. And Doris, oh, what happened, Doris? 
Mm, I used to angry, but now I'm more <laughs> patient <laughs> with the people. <laughs> really? All right, let me have one volunteer. One volunteer. Tell me, what do you do? No, okay, do you, Alex. Do you <laughs> tell share me. With, with the class how your life is different now. Ooh, you know, when uh, I I born in, in, in San Salvador, but I grew up in uh, Ilo Vasco, uh, Cabañas. But I remember when I was in my 18 years, or I went to the United States because ah the dreams of the United States, mm -hmm. but yes I uh, I to Mexico, but mm -hmm. foremost foremost and and then come back El Salvador, mm -hmm. but all time all time I enjoy my life I don't know why, but all time my smile is like a is part of me, mm -hmm. and the people says hey why you all time I smile. I don't know. It's, I, I feel that that <laughs> that happy in my in myself <laughs> in my heart. I don't know. <laughs> and all time, I I would like to um, enjoy dancing, travel, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. <laughs> and my responsibility is for my in in that time is what for myself. But okay. when, when I marry, that <laughs> that, that, that that thing changed. <laughs> my wife. After I don't know, then my my daughters, uh, then the the group, my family, mm -hmm. but all time is mine. And you know, all mm -hmm. time I say my daughters, hey, the life is for enjoy. Mm -hmm. The life is for enjoy. All time mm -hmm. I try, I mm -hmm. try, enjoy, okay. enjoy the life because it's important for me. All time I smile. Maybe mm -hmm. uh, it it happens some bad. I all time I find the positive that things about that. Uh -huh. And I, I try to live uh active, I I try to live uh smile, I mm -hmm. try to live positive and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. And yes. but right now the change, the mm -hmm. change totally is about my responsibility. Because okay. long time ago, I, I think about myself, but right now it's my family. Mm -hmm. it's, uh, the happy of my family. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, that's I have a, a lot of dreams. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, that's <laughs> awesome. That is very good. Well, I'm so happy to hear that. Applause yeah. for Alex. Yes. <laughs> good job, Alex. Select somebody, okay. Alex. Ivania Romero. Ask Ivania Hi, the Alex. question. <laughs> How are you, Ivania? Hello, I'm fine. Okay. Just relaxing my house after a hard work day. Okay. <laughs> yes. Um, what is the question, teacher, about the the change in my life or what? Yes. Yes. How has your life changed from when you were a little girl to now as an adult woman? Uh, well, um, I think the, the, the big change uh, in my life was when I have to move to Morazan um, to, to San Salvador because I want to um, study um, at the University of El Salvador and the, the career, um, it is impossible to, to finish the career at University of San Miguel. So I have to, I have to move. Okay. San Salvador, and that was the big change in my life because I live uh, all the time with my parents, mm -hmm. and I have to to live with my aunt. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I left my home, my my friends, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. my 
and you know my my sides when I live the the whole life. Mm-hmm. So it, it was a, a a big change for me, but okay. it uh, in the same way it, it was for me. I think uh, I become I became more independent. Mm-hmm. So so I I I don't have. I, I don't have a, uh, I didn't have a person uh, that is um, responsible uh, for me. It's mm-hmm. only, it's only me, it's my, are my responsibilities. Um, I had to, to cook for me. Mm-hmm. I had to, to do everything mm-hmm. only for me. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. I And how did you that, feel? What? How did that make you feel? Uh, in the at, at the first time was a little depressed because um, I miss my family all the days. Oh. Yes, but then I have to to study. I have to to pay attention on class. I had to do uh, the things on the right uh, way because my parents was uh, my parents were um, do an extra uh, how do you say um, cost or, or expense um, yes yes my parents were um, expense for me mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So I had to to do the the things to the right way. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's good. That's good. All right. But Thank that you. Is the, that that uh, that that part of my life uh, is I I think that part because uh, that become the 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 person that I am today. Correct, correct. Thank you so much, uh, Ivania, for sharing with us. All right, applause for Ivania, guys. Good job, Ivania. Excellent. Thank you. Okay, guys, we have to continue. So for the next activity is going to be section 1.5, listening exercise. You are going to listen to the audio program. Which person do you think would be more likely to do these things this weekend? Choose the right answer. You're going to work in pairs, and then we are going to work together as a class. Okay. You will have five minutes. Okay. It is about it is about um, listening, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, can you share your screen? Yes. Okay. okay. You didn't have the exercise. Be more likely to do these things this no, I see. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. Also. Marcos. Well, I. I guess the biggest change in my life over the last five years is that I got married. You know, I used to be into going out with friends every weekend, staying out late. And we were pretty wild and crazy back then. Now, I don't mind staying home. It's not so bad. I guess you could say that I started to grow up. I wasn't so interested in going out all the time. I wanted to settle down and have a family. I have to be honest. My heart wasn't. I mean, before I didn't mind being 
I don't know, but I can hear. I don't know if the, the other person. Hello? Okay. In, in... Okay. Yes, I listen. Can you hear Ivania? Yes, yes. Okay. But in in the in one part I can't. In two one I repeat again. Yes, um maybe after. Okay. okay. Funny one in the group. Can you believe it? So I'd say I'm much more friendly and outgoing now. I don't worry about speaking up and giving my opinion anymore. In fact, I'm thinking about joining a few more clubs so I can meet even more new people and do more things. I think the number one is either. Yes, I think that too. Okay. And the second one, it's Marcos. And the second one, if you want, yeah. If you want, you can put the audio. Okay. Okay. Which person do you think would be more likely to do these things this weekend? Check Marcus or Heather. One. Well, I guess the biggest change in my life over the last five years is that I got married. You know, I used to be into going out with friends every weekend and staying out late. I don't know what happened. Yes, I can hear. Please don't reproduce. You what can click the the um, um how do you say um in the corner there are a, a sign okay yes that Listen again. Which person do you think would be more likely to do these things this weekend? Check Marcos or Heather. One, Marcos. Well, I guess the biggest change in my life over the last five years is that I got married. You know, I used to be into going out with friends every weekend and staying out late. We were pretty wild and crazy back then. Now, I'm more of a family man. I don't mind staying at home, watching TV, that kind of thing. I'm even learning to cook. It's not so bad. I guess you could say that I started to grow up. 
I wasn't so interested in going out all the time. I was ready to settle down and have a family. I have to be honest, my heart wasn't really in the right place before. I mean, before I didn't mind being, well, a little irresponsible at times, even selfish. I was always out having fun with my friends, but I never wanted to hear about their problems. I just didn't care. But with my wife and little boy, it's different. I'm trying to become more, you know, more kind and generous. I want to be there to help them out, no matter how small the problem. Two, Heather. I have to say, five years ago, I was a completely different person. I never said much in a crowd, and I always tried to avoid making small talk with people I didn't know very well. But really, I was just incredibly shy and reserved. Anyway, then I went away to college, and I had this roommate, Nora. She had a great sense of humor and laughed at all my jokes. That really gave me a lot of confidence. Nora and I joined a small study group at school. When we finish studying, a bunch of us go out for coffee. Conversation is easy because we all have a lot of the same interests. Now my new friends think of me as the funny one in the group. Can you believe it? So I'd say I'm much more friendly and outgoing now. I don't worry about speaking up and giving my opinion anymore. In fact, I'm thinking about joining a few more clubs so I can meet even more new people and do more things. Listening. Okay. Okay. Um, number first, Heather. It's Marcos. Sí, yes, Marcos. Marcos stay on late at big party. No. Number one is Heather. It's Heather. Ah, yes. yes. Stay home and watch TV. It's Marcos. At late, Marcos. Number three. Heather. It's Marcos. 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 <laughs> okay. And number four is Heather. Heather. Okay. Thanks. What do we have to do? <laughs> I don't know, maybe it's only the exercise, right? Yes. Okay. But we have time. Maybe for speaking. <laughs> okay. Enrique. Hello. Hello, Hello. Enrique. Uh, uh, All right, let me have Alexander, number one, please. Okay, number one, Heather. Heather, thank yes. you. Number two, Ivania. Marcos. Marcos. Number three, Mirna. Marcos. Marcos. Number four, Marvin. Heather. Heather. All right. Excellent work. Good job, guys. That is correct. Any questions related to this activity over here? 
or about the vocabulary? No. Okay. Let's move on to section number 1.6. At the end of this section, participants will be able to understand and use noun clauses after the be verb. Noun clauses after the be verb. Listen, please. Can everybody hear? Hi. Please read the following article. Can you hear? Can you find the noun yes, clause? Yes, 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 teacher. Example? Okay. I'll give you 30 seconds to read it and identify it. You may begin. Okay. So what you're going to do is you're going to read about the Wat Watsons, the Wangs, and the Patels. Did you find it? Let's do it together. There is only one bathroom. Noun clauses have to be. Remember, a noun clause is a group of words that function together as a noun. It can be the subject of a sentence or the object of a verb. We want you to pay attention on. The word that signals the beginning of a noun clause. That in noun clauses after be is optional. Also notice the prepositions that are used with the following noun. Let's work on an example. One benefit of being an only child is that you get a lot of attention. That you get a lot of attention is a noun clause. Every noun clause has a subject and a predicate. In the above example, you is the subject and get is the verb. Complete the sentences with your own ideas. Then, compare them with a partner in class. Number one, an advantage of being a twin. Number two, a problem with being an only child. Okay, so you're going to give me at least five examples. You're going to use the advantage of being a twin and what's the other one she said complete the sentences with your own ideas then compare them with a partner in class number one an advantage of being a twin number two a problem with being an only child a problem with being an only child Okay, so you're going to give me at least three examples with the advantage of being a twin and three problems with being an only child. And you are going to write the examples here in the discussion forum. You can write the same examples as your partners work together. You can write the same examples. Three and three. <laughs> advantage of being the first the first son is or the first daughter is that you have to care your brothers <laughs> ah, okay <laughs> um what is the for the first one? The advantage of being a dream. Yes. 
yes. you, you care your brother, you say, right? Yes. Okay, the advantage of being a twin is that you care your brother. Okay, another? You can put your brother's clothes, probably. I can hear you what? You can put your brother's clothes. Clothes. Ah, yes. You can share your clothes. Yes, yes. you can share your clothes. Um, another is maybe... Um, is... Maybe, maybe you have the probability to uh, to have a, a to have your your what do you say? Um, your son or or your daughter maybe can be a twin too yes yes maybe it's a bunch of or one other um, you can feel i think the, the saints with your your brother or your sister yes you can feel or you can you can feel um what the what what the other person can feel or i don't know i heard that maybe the twins feel like the other uh. You can, uh, you, you have similar tastes, feelings. Yes, that is the, you uh, have similar feelings, yes. I don't know the meaning of twin. 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 Twin is like gemelo, right? Uh-huh, yes. yes, I got thinking. Yes. And the problem is that people are confusing with, with the other person. <laughs> uh, yes, yes. In my case, you know, uh, the friends always says that my daughter is like, like me. But I don't but know. The problem, the problem is the, the next one. Yes. Well, the problem about, the problem with being an only child is when you don't have siblings. Yes. Yes. Uh, a problem with Problem, uh, a problem with being an only child is that you don't have you don't have a, a partner to to play for play. Yes, for playing. Yes. What else? The problem also, I think, is the person who, who is only child is a lot of selfish. Hello. 
de la de la profesora. La chioma de la Hello. Hello, thank you. Hello. I think that the partner have problems with the internet. Ah, uh, maybe. Hello, Omi. Hello, Mirna. Hello, hello. Hello. How are you? Very well, thank you. you. I can complain, but it's good to yeah. tell me what are you doing or what are we doing, what we are doing. I think we have to answer the two questions the teachers give. Ah, and you copy that. Does uh, uh, uh those questions? The advantage of being a twin. Excuse me. See you again. The advantage of being a twin. Ah, okay. As bad as when of being a twin. Hello, Alex. Hey, hello. Hey, what happened? I don't understand. Omi and Enrique with us. Yes. 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 No, I don't. I don't. I can't really understand that. It's this activity. About the advantage of the when I a teenager or I don't know what no, what is the, the number, activity. The number one is about the uh, the advantage about the twins, and it's advantage. If what, what happened? What is the advantage to the uh, the parents have a twins, for example? Ah. Uh -huh. And the number two, actually, uh, actually, I I don't know, but. But Mirna told me it's about the hijo único. What mm -hmm. that to yes. problems, uh -huh. problems I... with, with being. Mm -hmm. But it is not advantage, I have problem. I, yes. I, I think that you have often very receptive brain. Um, I don't know. Ah. They, can, they, they can also work to develop and improve their brain. Mm -hmm. uh, what it, is that? Uh, I think is that the advantage about the twins. Twins, the twins. Yeah, of course. Yes, uh, but for example, but for for the mother, for the mother, the mother, the advantage is one is is one time to pregnant is two. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Like, like uh -huh. that. Uh huh. And it's for the, example, about the two persons. Okay. Yeah, of course. Yes. And for example, the twins all time have a company because sometimes it's, it's the same time and uh, uh, play together and sometimes fight about but the idea is all time is, is, is together. Yeah, and they can learn very fast or no, they can learn faster and uh -huh. better than others. Yes, yes. Uh, for example, uh, if they, they use the same clothes, for example. In the, in the moment to buy a some clothes, is maybe is, is in that case, it's not advantage exactly, but because it's, it's more expensive because it's, you have to buy to for two uh, person. But sometimes maybe they can uh, mix or combine the clothes. I don't know. I yeah, trying. but girls, they combine the clothes is uh, very uh -huh. interesting about the team. Uh -huh. And I love it when the twin change don't change your <laughs> process. <laughs> okay. Okay. And, and, and share your uh, 
feelings too. When uh, sometimes uh, brothers uh, can smile, uh -huh. the other person smile too. Hello, Ivania, are you finished? Hello, teacher. Hi, how are I, you? Are you finished? I lost my group because oh. I had to take a call. Oh, okay. But we speak uh, about it. Okay, that's awesome. Okay, guys, okay. time's up. Time's up. Okay. We're going to okay. stop. See you guys tomorrow. Okay, you. Have bye a good bye. night. Enjoy. Bye. 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 Bye.